I remember looking in the mirror and seeing myself having no jawline. It was just very weird because it kind of kind of looked like I had a double chin. Even if I did go to the gym, if I if I did try to gain a nicer jawline, it just didn't seem to work. It was all because I didn't put enough effort into the actual jawline. So I was actually training everything else. I was doing whatever I had to do. For example, my diet, the gym, right? But I didn't specifically train or put any more effort or research towards my jawline and how I can actually fix it and make it look better, right? And a lot of the times I didn't know that my jawline was the actual problem and that's what I had to fix you know, for my whole face to look better actually, right? So whenever I found out, whenever I put in more work, research, did everything I had to do, now we're here today and there's so much of a difference and I can see that nice jawline that can cut through diamonds and I feel amazing, right? And that's what we want for you as well. And that's why I'll give you a fast and effective guide to create a sharp jawline. I remember looking in the mirror one day and seeing my face become way more angular, right? So I don't know if you can see this through the video right here, but my jawline just became way more sharp and my cheekbones as well. And in general, like all my features started looking way more sharp and nice. And I was thinking like, why did this happen? And I was trying to analyze this and think like, wait, what did I actually do in the last few weeks, months that has helped me get a way more angular face? That's why I had to find out what was the factor behind this and it turns out that it was the mouth tape so i don't know if you have ever heard before but using a mouth tape is actually fucking amazing so look at this right this is a macro pore tape and i use it every single night before i go to bed so i cut up a small piece like this something like this yeah and i just put it on my mouth like this and then i go to sleep so like this is also like a small tip. So if you're gonna cut your tape, do this before you put it down. So like fold it a little bit like this, right? So like it's a small fold. So it doesn't, you know, you don't, don't lose it between whatever, right? It's like always there. You just pull it out, cut it up. That's it, right? So you don't have to dig in with your nails and shit. So I've been using a mouth tape for like two, three months now. But I remember the change has particularly happened in the first like three to four weeks of me using it, right? So it's nothing quick, but it also doesn't take a lot of time. And in my opinion, it's very important because if you think about it, whenever you go to sleep, right? Your mouth breathes a lot of the times, especially if you are a snorer, right? You mouth breathe. And that does not help with your jawline, just literally worsens it and it makes it look like you have a shit jawline or you basically look like you have a double chin, like you don't have anything else, right? So it's like your jawline disappears and we don't want that. That's why you close your mouth with the tape and it forces your body to breathe through your nose, right? That way, first of all, you get way more fucking oxygen in your brain. So when you wake up, you feel way more energized. And second of all, you kind of mew while sleeping. So that way you're getting the benefits of you know, having a nice jawline while not even trying too hard, just putting on a piece of tape before going to sleep and that's it. So try this for yourself. One of these is like one or two euros, one or two dollars, whatever. In my opinion, this is very effective and I've been using this for like three months now. So if I just spend like two dollars for this and it still has like a fuck ton left, it's like very worth it. In my opinion, you should try it at least once to see if it works or not. But you have to be consistent every single night to put it on maybe have like a to-do list just to not forget because that's how you're gonna get most of the results. I remember there was a point when I was in middle school and high school where I used to put on a t-shirt and I looked like I was a twig, right? So underneath I was jacked because I've been working out for like eight years now, eight to nine years. So why did I look like I was a twig? It was because my neck was small, right? And this is not just like for neck training or whatever. This also helps your jawline because in my opinion, this is like a kind of two birds with one stone type of thing where you train your neck, right? First of all, you look bigger in general because when you put on a t-shirt, a turtleneck, whatever, you just look bigger and like it matches your proportions basically. The second right? thing would be to chew harder foods, right? So I'm not gonna waste your time here, but you just have to eat way more food, which is harder to chew, right? Whenever you go to the gym 
and you do some ab curls, right? At some point when you do enough reps, your abs start hurting a lot, right? But you have to keep going until you finish. This is the exact same thing, but with you chewing something because a lot of the times you have some type of food which is harder to chew, but then you have to finish your whole plate, right? So you're chewing, you're chewing, you're chewing, and you have like no break for your teeth basically, right? For your jaw. At some point you're gonna feel fatigued. You're gonna feel like, oh, I cannot like chew anymore because my jaw hurts. That's what, that's the point we want you to get to. Because we don't want you to just chew a little bit of food, which is kind of hard, and you're like, oh, that's it, right? We don't want that. So that you're training your jawline. You don't need to buy rubber balls or whatever people are selling just to train your jaw to gain a nicer jawline, right? And lastly, this is for you guys who have a beard, right? So if you have a big beard, right? Huge. Or you have like a stubble and you're not really cleaning it up. You don't really care about the way it looks. What I would suggest for you to do is look at your beard right now, right? If you have neck beard right here, basically, you're not really going to the barber, you don't really care, then I would suggest for you to start caring because if you truly want a jawline that stands out, that looks nice and sharp, that makes you look more angular, you know, and attractive, then you want to take care of your jawline and give that illusion that it's even sharper than it really is, right? And the best way to do that is by trimming your beard down in a way that your neck beard is gone, right? And also you line up your beard and kind of like highlights your jawline, right? So we don't want to just mew and chew hard foods, right? We also want your jawline to seem like it's way more sharp than it already is. So this is like a quick step, a quick fix, which you can do, right? So line up your beard in a nice way, right? You can go to a barbershop, you can watch a YouTube tutorial about this. These are the best tips to help your jawline improve. And of course, let's not forget that you have to mew, but that's like, in my opinion, what everybody has to do nowadays. It's not like it's optional. You have to do it to get to the certain point. And the fastest way to do it is by compounding every single tip that I've just told you in this video and doing everything at once. Because if you just mew a little bit here, a little bit of mouth tape here, and you don't trim your beard or whatever, and you're very inconsistent, of course your results are gonna be much slower. So if you want to gain that nice jawline as fast as possible, you have to compound every single tip that I told you. And believe me, bro, you need a few months and you're gonna gain that sharp jawline that's gonna be able to cut diamonds. And bro, like the before and after is gonna be crazy. If you're interested in maximizing your looks and you want a network of like-minded guys, Click the first link in the description to join our movement. There's also a free course in there to help you start your attractiveness journey starting now. Stop wasting time.